Hi, Ben van den Burg with Never Enough Strats with a nice Custom Shop 65 model uh, from 2013. Uh, 65, important year for Fender because uh, it's the year that CBS acquired Fender. Uh, sort of a transition year. Um, in 66, uh, the new big headstock came. So this is uh, made to the specs of the, the final version of the Stratocaster with the small headstock. Um, it was relicked in a closet, closet classic way um, not very much dings and scratches on it but a beautiful beautiful checkered nitro finish in the sunburst finish really really pretty um, some specs uh, most of them all the things are uh, are vintage so like the vintage tuners um, it has a rosewood fretboard, but it's a round lamb, so not a slab board. Uh, well, uh, 65, so they started to um, uh, be a bit more careful with the very expensive and rare rosewood. Um, it's quite light, three and a half kilos only, so uh, very nice and light guitar. Uh, excellent shape, uh, the guitar. Uh, hardly any markings of the neck being played here and there a little bit but but very good condition nice neck uh, 65 uh, specs neck a uh, bit thinner i think than the early 60 um, models that i've had the custom shop models that i had i wish i had a real 62 of course but that's uh, nearly impossible for us normal people um greenish Pickguard, white, uh, all the, the knobs and the pickup covers are white. Um, and very special, it has uh, 65 voiced pickups made by the one and only Abigail Ibarra. So, um, uh, dated two two 2012. Uh, and of course, well, they're highly wanted in the market the Ibarra pickups uh, because they were hand, hand wound by the master herself um, short story she uh, started really early, early after the invention of the Stratocaster has been working for Fender for 53 years has retired by now uh, learned the craft of hand winding a pickup from Leo Fender her, himself and uh, she gave her the craft uh, she she learned the craft to, uh, to other now master pickup makers uh, so uh, very special pickups in this guitar um, yeah what can I say I'll, I'll show you some details of the beautiful checking of the of the lacquer nice playing guitar great sounding and to see how great it sounds I'll uh, play some tunes for you. Um, like always, open G chord so you can compare all the guitars and some noodling. First posi position, uh, neck pickup. Oh, and by the way, it has modern wiring. So uh, second knob is for the tone control of the neck and middle pickup. And the third knob is for the tone control of the bridge. So that's... I think the only modern feature about this guitar. All right, here we go. G chord. Okay, second position, um, neck and middle pickup. Nice and resonant, I can... Mm -hmm. 
This is how it sounds like without the amp on. Don't know if you can hear it. Quite loud for an electric guitar. Uh, still second position, by the way. Middle position. Fourth position. Fifth final position. Okay, I want to try out something new because I always play all the positions uh, in a clean amp. Uh, but now I can imagine that you also want to hear how it sounds like when it's a bit more dirty. So I put my uh, little Blackstar amp on the second channel. Uh, so with a bit of gain. Sounds good. Or maybe also, f so this was first position in uh, the overdrive channel and this is the fifth position just to uh, see what it sounds like. Okay, a great sounding guitar, Abigail Ibarra pickups, uh, great looks. Um, if you love a, a three tone sunburst, then and you like a bit of relicking, then this might be the guitar for you. Uh, very comfortable to play. So uh, check it out and check out all the strats that I have on my website, neveroenoughstrats.com. Um, if you like this video, like and subscribe, that would help a lot. And of course, I uh, bid you a lot of fun playing your, I hope, Fender Strat.